Ooh, welcome everyone to another episode of Slasher Scotty. I am your host, Scotty McCoy, and boy, do I have a surprise for all of you. I have on Zoom with me right now, Ikeem Bozeman, and he's going to be playing Michael in the upcoming TV series. Let me see if I pronounce this right. Church plus main or church and main? Yeah, it's church and main. Church and main. So uh, it's nice to have you on my show, Ikeem. How are you doing tonight? Hey, can't complain, man. I'm here, so. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm so glad that we can make this happen. So the first question I got for you is, how did you get your start into acting? Um, well, you know, I've, I've always been an actor most of my life, man, Um, from doing all kinds of sorts of things, from talent shows, because I'm a huge dancer. So that was really my first go-to, talent shows, Um. I was an all-around athlete, so I played four sports. Um, so, you know, I've always been an actor, and I've also done theater kind of in between all of that. Not a lot, but just here and there. Um, so, you know, that that right there just kind of put me on that acting course, you know. And, and, it, and it, you know, it, it runs through through my family, too. You know, we have, a, a you know, a lot of people in my family who's done from musicians to athletes mm -hmm. to, you know, at, you know artists so you know it's just yeah. it's in me it's something i've always wanted to do since five years old that's awesome that's awesome and i, I mean you do have an and you do have a, a big acting uh family i know that for sure <laughs> right yep um so uh how did you happen to land the role of church in maine well you know hey it's just i'm gonna say you know it, it was definitely the, the the man above man opening that door for me because um it was actually supposed to have been for another talent that's under my manager you know it's you know we we you know pretty cool um so they they wrote this character a certain way that they mm -hmm. saw fit and um so they you know they had and you know it was worldwide auditions coming mm -hmm. in from all place so um yeah so you know my manager reached out to me and the guy that was supposed to get it uh, wasn't uh, connecting or communicating with him. So um, she reached out to me or reached out to Three King Studios, mm -hmm. the ones who are who's on the show, and um, told them about me. And it was like, yeah, you know, let's give them a shot. And so I had like 24 hours mm -hmm. to get the sides down and the next day pretty much do it live. You know, everyone else yeah. had to have time to self-tape and do all that so I had like 24 hours to get it down and be ready to do it live so um so when I done it you know I, I had it down like five minutes I told him I was like man we could have done it that night I was uh, so um so I done it um in front of them in front of uh, on live and mm -hmm. um you know they just kind of you know I done it and they was like okay wow you know that's that's yeah. awesome that's it but could you could you kind of do it like a little fast because Michael's right. kind of like that that uh fast talkative person kind of awkwardness type person um so I was like okay cool I'll adjust I'll do it and I've done it and it was just like wow man like okay now that's it no they they told me like they wrote it a certain way but I just kind of came in and kind of gave it a little twist so to speak right. but they loved it and you know so you know I'm just thankful for them believing in me and my my skills, my talent, and uh, giving me the, you know, the opportunity to play that character. So, you know, that's how Absolutely. I landed that. Yeah. So for those that are unaware, what is church uh, church and main about? Um, well, I'll tell you this because <laughs> there are certain things that I can't say, but yep. I will tell you this, and you could you could see what it's all about. For the listeners and whoever's watching, uh go to three kingstudios.com mm -hmm. uh the site. And you know what we about to shoot here on the twenty starting on the twenty eighth of this month is the prequel to the series. Mm -hmm. So that's what we're gonna be doing first. Um, so go on the uh, website threekingstudios.com. Mm -hmm. It'll give you the story of the prequel and the whole series. You awesome. know you can read that. Um, and while you're doing it, check out the merch store because I mean mm -hmm. I'm telling you, it's so many options. <laughs> the merch is amazing. Um, right. and um, right now there's a discount code uh 10 percent off of everything and the code is for everybody who's listening and watching mm -hmm. tonight scotty yep. <laughs> just, just scotty yep. and uh 
got your discount code for ten percent off of everything, and that's awesome. good. Leave until next week, if I'm correct. If that's awesome. what they told me. So yeah, you know, you can do that. But man, mm -hmm. I'm, this this is definitely one of those series that I believe would be, you know, a top series that everybody nice. attacked. It's it's that amazing. Nice. So, is there anything you could tell us about your character, like? maybe personality traits um i know you can't go too much into it but anything you can give us um yeah like i said uh just not too long ago he's like he's he's smart he's like tech savvy mm -hmm. um but uh he's he has that like cool awkwardness not like you know normally when somebody's awkward it's kind of like but his is, is a little different you know it's mm -hmm. like a cool awkwardness but you know it's, it 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 tells on you like i, I mean yeah. like i he he definitely will have a lot of fans that attach to him even though he got that kind of awkwardness that fast talking mm -hmm. talking type person um but you know he's like like i said at the end of the day he's just a smart guy he's yeah. um kind of like the life of the party type character yeah. is how I see it. um you know all about just being there for his friends and you know just just mm -hmm. being being help a helping hand so that's what I can say right now until yeah. we start, you know, because I'm right. excited. I'm excited to bring Michael to life. I really am. Absolutely. I, and I can't wait to see this. Um, where will it be able to be, like, viewed? Like, it, what, is there any uh, channels, like, any cable channels or anything or streaming? Um, Right now, I'm not really sure on that. I, I, okay. I'm, I believe it will be on the streaming. But okay. right now, just until we finish and they give us all that information afterwards. But awesome. you definitely. It'll definitely be out for people to see, no doubt. I just, we have to wait awesome. till we shot. Well, whenever it's out, just, uh, you know, shoot me a message and I'll be more than happy to, uh, you know, promote it and uh, share it to all my, all my listeners, all my viewers. Um, so that way we can get the word out as well. Um, so in terms of being an actor, what do you believe the biggest challenge is for being an actor? And what do you believe is the easiest part about being an actor? The biggest challenge uh, that I've uh, seen so far is just, um, you know, just staying co consistent with you, you know, with with mm -hmm. all the characters you have, staying on top of everything, um, mm -hmm. you know, just not falling off because it, it 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 is easy to do. You can get distracted and mm -hmm. or or have days where you just, mm -hmm. oh, I don't feel like going over this script or yeah. I just, don't, but you know, just staying focused, staying the course. Um, mm -hmm. And just, you know, keep at it every day, even while you wait to start production. Mm -hmm. And, you know, just, just find a ton of things to keep you at it busy from yeah. studying or, you know, just reading yeah. things to better your craft. That's that's what I would say. Um, and what was the other question? What was the easiest part about being an actor in your mind? The easiest part? Well, for me, just, you know, getting out there in front of everybody and just doing something you know because right. i've always been that way you know just once i'm out there mm -hmm. and i'm on the stage or football feel like i said anything and i'm just you know mm -hmm. just going at it you know it just absolutely goes in you and there you are you know it just mm -hmm. keep it Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, so do you have any advice for people that may want to pursue acting? Like, do you have any advice on what you would like that, like anything that you can give to help them, you know, pursue their dreams? I will say the number one thing is, you know, never give up, you know, um, if you believe in it and if that's what you want to do, go for it. Yeah. Yeah. You can, you can have your challenges and your, your blocks and all that, you know, but that's mm -hmm. everyday life and, it, and anything. But you know, just keep going. You know, yeah. Uh, yeah, a, a dream is never too big, and my, you know, mm -hmm. you you say just keep working at it, and you can do it. Uh, stay Absolutely. focused. Um, you know, just g give a give all you got in it. You know, mm -hmm. like I say, even if you know something's not happening right then, mm -hmm. just keep working towards it, and that door will open. You know, yeah. you know, you will get. All you'll get probably more no's than you will yeses, but all mm -hmm. those no's are leading up to a major yes or a major yeah. door open. So, you know, just stay at it. You know, that's just like me growing up, you know, something mm -hmm. this big of a dream, it doesn't come by to just anybody. You exactly. Know, you just, and it's hard to come by. So coming up, growing up since five, 
with it being my dream, you know, I've had times mm-hmm. where I'm just like, man, I, that's that's mm-hmm. too big of a dream. I don't, I, right. you know, I don't think it's coming. But at the same time, I maintained my focus and mm-hmm. just kept in and put myself out there. And yeah, he, and he opened that door for me, man. So, yeah, I'm just here I am. Absolutely. Um, so the last question I got for you, um, do you have any other projects, websites, social media accounts, or anything else that you would like to plug and promote to the listening and viewing audience? Um, yeah, so my social media, um, I have both my Facebook pages, my personal and my Atlas page, both of them uh, simple, I King Bozeman. Um, so, you know, it's not hard to find. Again, I King Bozeman, my Instagram, my personal and Atlas page. Uh, my personal is I King Bozeman 97 and my address page is just I King Bozeman. So when you go on there and type those in, you usually will see the other one somewhere near it. So, you know, it's not hard to find. My Twitter is I Bozeman 97. Again, I Bozeman 97 is my Twitter. My TikTok is I King Bozeman 97. Um, so again, you know, just put I King Bozeman in, uh, and it, it'll be easy to find. So, uh, so, so that's that. Um, as far as projects, yeah, I have a, uh, I'm, I'm pretty, I'll say I'm, I have a good bit to film the rest of this year. Um, a lot of traveling to do that I'm excited about. Mm-hmm. Um, and there's some that's in talks that are pretty major with some major A-listers for this year and nice. some even way to 2023. So I'm, you know, I'm, there's, they, they coming in and mm-hmm. keeping, so, you know, again, thank, shout out to my manager. Angela Anderson, you know, she's amazing. Nice. Um, the cast for Church of Maine, I cannot forget about mm-hmm. you guys. And, you know, just Three mm-hmm. Kings Studios in general, shout out to them. Yeah. Uh, the, the lead, Colin David Beach. Um, then we have Carmen Shreve, uh, Sean Stevens, and Candace Carter. You know, that's the cast, phenomenal nice. cast. I mean, everybody's going to fall in love with this cast. So shout mm-hmm. out to them. I'm excited. I'm ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And you, you, you're you doing a great job. And I know that uh, I, I, I didn't want to bring this up, like, you know, as part of because this is your interview, but your cousin, Chadwick Boseman, uh, I'm sure he's very proud of you. Um, you know, Black Panther himself. And I mean, he's proud of what you're really doing on your own and you're doing a great job. And I really can't wait to see this because we were speaking before our interview. And uh, as a Christian myself, it's, you know, this is going to be a, a series that I can't wait to see myself. And I, like I said, hit me up with all the, all the information when it comes out and I'll be more than happy to share it for you um, and get it out as well. And I can see big things for you. And I really look forward to seeing the future projects you're also going to be working on. Awesome, man. Yeah, I am yeah. too. Um, I would definitely, I would definitely reach out to you once uh, mm-hmm. we finish and find out what it'll be streaming on, whatever. And yeah. So, I mean, and, and before we end it, you know, like I said, or whenever we do, yeah, I have a, I have a couple Westerns, um, okay. horror films I'm excited about, yes. um, drama films. So, yeah, you know, it's a lot. Um, some TV series, uh, right. also a couple of those, um, you know, a lot of travel. Like I said, going to Europe for the first time. It's That's point. exciting. <laughs> um, which, if I may ask, which country in Europe? Uh, Budapest, Hungary. Oh, nice! Movie. A lot of major, yeah. So I'm, I'm really excited about that. That'll be my first time. Yeah, that's exciting. Uh, I mean, I'll, I'll be more than happy to have you on again uh, to promote any other projects you have coming up, and we'll, we'll, you know, give them shout outs and give them plugs, and you know, definitely uh, help you out and help your projects out because I believe in, you know, helping out, you know, any type of actors. I, I'm more than happy to help them out with their projects. I love promoting it. Awesome, man. We can do yep. that anytime. Yep. Um, Absolutely. Cool. Absolutely. Well, you have a great rest of your night, Akeem, and thank you so much for joining me. You too, my friend. Same All to right. you. All right. Have a good one. <laughs> Bye. All right. Goodbye. Bye.